This is a joke, mate. No joke, mate. It's what happened. I'm in Afghanistan stewing in sweat and fear and blood. And when I get home, my kid brother is found swinging from the rafters. The groundsman cut him down. True story. But this is terrible. It's been hushed up, naturally. Sixteen generations of French Catholic suicides about as shameful as it gets, not to mention a faggot cop-out. So why are we here? I need to get to the bottom of it. Family honour's at stake. I need to know what happened. So, there's no party and it's just us. What, this is some sort of setup? You're his friends. I thought you might be able to help. Come on, Paul. We're going. I can't drive. I'm pissed. There was a party at the end of the summer term. I think something might have happened there. He topped himself, mate. It's sad, but it happens. I don't see what we can do about it. And you shouldn't have got us to come here under false pretenses. That's just out of order. This was in his pocket. Did any of you send it? This is the key. This is what drove him to it. Truth or dare, bitch. <laughs> what does it mean? I mean, you're his friends. You must have some idea. I've had enough of this. I'm leaving. Who's coming? Well, we can't take the cars. Yeah, well, we can take our chances. Uh, I'm not finished yet, Chris. Well, I am. Step aside. I can't do that. when people don't follow orders. Luke, the chairs, bring them. Do it! Justin, I don't know what it is you think we've done, but really, you've got this wrong. All wrong, we haven't done anything. You need to Gemma. stop us. Quiet. Eleanor, Gemma, take a seat. This is it, isn't it? This is why we're here. I said take a seat. some bloody common sense. <laughs> Luke, bring over the other chairs. Snap to it! <laughs> then collect up the car keys and their mobile phones. There's a lockbox on the workbench. Waiting, mate. Picking the right moment. This is not that moment. I'm quicker than you and I've got a gun. <laughs> I absolutely won't miss. Now, I need you to get up slowly. chair with your hand behind your back and sit down. Can you do that for me? You don't have to say anything. Just nod if you're cool.
this on yourselves, guys. But it can all be over very soon. I just need one of you to own up to sending the postcard. And then we're all done here. We don't know who sent the postcard. Please, we don't know. He doesn't care if we know or not. He just wants to screw with us. Don't you? You've got a few moments to talk it over. I'll be outside. But I'll be watching. Luke. With me. Did you send the postcard, Luke? No way, man. I hardly knew your brother. No offence. Just a party guy. I bring the drugs and mix the drinks. Shallow as fuck, seriously. They should be thanking you, Luke. If you hadn't have helped out, things might have got a bit more... Messy. You're a good man. This business with the postcard. I don't know, maybe you should just let it go. I can't do that, mate. I need answers. You can see that, right? Yeah, I mean, you're obviously upset about what happened. I am upset, Luke. I'm very upset. I don't want to play these games. Of course not. <clears throat> this is fucking fucked up. It's what you said, Chris. Truth or dare, bitch. It's what you said to Felix. What are you trying to say? That I sent the postcard? Well, I know I didn't send it. You bitch, you're going to set me up, aren't you? You're going to tell him about the fight. Calm down, Chris. Don't tell me to calm down. Chris. Shut the hell up. That asshole is going to get us killed. He says he didn't send it. He said it, mate. He said, truth or dare, bitch. Did you? <sighs> it's not a secret. Other people heard. They could have passed it on. Yeah, but you're the one that said it. So what if I said it? Why the fuck would I write on a postcard, for Christ's sake? It's because I chucked you, isn't it? What? I said it was because of the way you treated Felix. I said that was why I was dumping you. Shit! I didn't send the postcard! If Chris says he didn't send the postcard, then he didn't send the fucking postcard. End of discussion. All of us are in deep shit here. All of us. Now, let's focus on getting out of it, OK? Now, keep twisting at your tape. <laughs> Go for strong, but he stretches. One of us might be able to work a hand for you. So tell me about the party. What do you want to know? Do you see Felix there? Yeah, I saw him. Did you talk to him? Did he seem all right to you? He was good, you know. He was fine. Chris mentioned something with Gemma. Uh, Felix fancied her. I told him to go for it, you know. I said, end of term, anything goes. <laughs> you think she was out of his league? No way. <laughs> he just needed to be confident, because that's what the girl's like. Just a bit of confidence. So you sold him drugs? It was just a couple of lines, I swear. I was just trying to help. That was an error of judgment. Just a party guy. <laughs> Gemma. There's a workbench just a few feet behind you. There's a drawer. There may be some tools we could use. Okay. I'll try to reach it. There'll be a phone line as well at the main house. Probably a burglar alarm too, so we need to we need to get the police here if we can. Okay, how are you doing? You okay? Better than you, babe. <laughs> I'll be okay. I'll be okay. You think Chris could have sent the postcard? 
I don't know. Maybe. But really, I, I, I don't know. Can I count on you, Luke? Of course. Might get a little hairy. I don't want you getting any ideas. Absolutely not. Just want to get through this. We all do. Good man. None of us sent the car, Justin. Seriously. This hasn't gone too far. You can just set us free, walk away. No one will talk. You have my word. Here's the deal. Someone owns up to sending the postcard. I let you all go. And if no one owns up? Well, then we play truth or dare. You're full of shit, man. And we'll see who's full of what. Dare, Gemma. Pick one. Truth. Who do you think sent the postcard? I don't know. I want your honest opinion. Honestly, I don't know. Try that again. In your honest opinion, who among the people gathered here do you think is most likely to have sent the postcard? Chris. Oh, oh Jim. I'm sorry. I didn't know who else to say. Oh, she doesn't know, Justin. She's saying it because she's scared. Gemma dumped Chris because of Felix. Maybe he wanted revenge. That's ridiculous. When we were driving, you did say you wanted to hit him. Yeah, I want to hit everyone. Did you send the postcard? I did not. Fuck! Wait. What was, what was the postmark? What was the date on the card? 